They're very simple, but they're very important to me. Um, you know, I make sure that I walk around the building a lot. I go down, I, like we have wonderful workshops. Like we, we have the best people in the world. And I think, you know, as Canadians, we take these things for granted. We think they exist there. They don't. Like the workshops at the Stratford Festival, like outside, in Germany, there's some places that have them. There's nothing like it now in, in the English speaking world. It's been outsourced everywhere. And what that means is that if you're going to make costumes or a set for a play in New York City, you get the designs and you give them to the shop. And if there are any, and you get exactly what you've handed in, okay? If there are any changes, there are change orders. But what that means is that there is a disconnect between the people creating it and the play itself, right? In our shops, the designers, like we have the actors on site, we have these wonderful fittings, a series of fittings, and every single detail about the costume, the prop, the wig, everything, is chosen to tell a story. The shape of the costume, the color of the fabric, how it's been dyed. We have people who, dis who destroy the costumes, right? Spend a lot of money making them, and then maybe we make them look lived in. We have people who paint the costumes. So to get to see all of that is such a fantastic experience. If you spend all your time in the office, you know, you get kind of hyperactive, and you actually be begin to believe the stuff that's happening there. You have to actually get out and see, you know, and you can decide why you're working. For me, it's, it's part of that. I also, you know, I make it a point to take an interest in the families and the pe of the people I work with to try to get to. I know all this sounds really motherhood, and, but, but that's the things that I, I gained by this. And it leads to a lot more satisfaction. It also leads to a kind of sense of togetherness and loyalty that I've gone through some tough times in my career. If I hadn't made those investments of actually going and spending time with people, I don't think I'd be here today. There's, doing that is, there's no, there's no substitute for it. You can't buy it. It's about making those investments in other people because one day you're gonna need them, right? No matter how perfect you are, you're gonna need the people around you. So that's like, I think some of the most important things is getting out, uh, spending time with people, it, it being interested in them, and, and in genuine way, you know? Um, so, and that's one of the reasons why I, I stopped acting and I, I've taken much more interest in directing plays and, and, and I find the process of directing a play is, is probably great school for management because when you're directing a play with a group of people, okay, that what's critically important for the director is to articulate what it's going to look like, what you find of interest, what's beautiful about it, what it's gonna feel like, um, to create an exciting vision for them and then to step back and invite them to make a contribution. Because then, when people come up with ideas, and you know, not all the ideas are gonna be good, but my experience is that you gotta at least try them. And if it doesn't work out, the very first person to say, you know what, that didn't work, is the person who offered the idea, right? But if the idea works, first of all, you look like a genius, even though it wasn't yours. But more importantly, the person who contributed the idea has now an investment, right? They've got some skin in the game. It's actually theirs. They own it. Whereas if you tell people exactly what to do and, and make sure you're horrible to them if they don't, and believe me, I've been directed that way before, um, there's no investment. People actually get quite invested in making sure the thing screws up <laughs> because they feel resentful, right? If they allow their, if you allow them to bring their creativity forward, to make a contribution, to make it better, it's theirs. Nothing can replace that, right? 